Welcome to Mr. Woods Teaches Middle School Math Survival Guide. I'm Fred Woods, ready to teach. Hi mathematicians, welcome to Mr. Woods Teaches. And today we're going to be reviewing just what ratio and percent basics of it here. So percent means out of 100 and is represented using the percent symbol here. So we have this one square and it says it's 1 of 100 because we know that this is 100 square. If it doesn't have it marked as 100 square, you can count it up. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 rows. And then we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 columns. 10 times 10 is 100. So this is 1 of 100. 1 of 100 equals this ratio here. This is a ratio. It's 1 over 100 or 1%. So if we had 8 of these, it would be 8 over 100 or 8%. 27 would be 27 percent or 27 over 100. Now there's other ways to represent this ratio but that'll be in a later video. Here it reads write a ratio and a percent to represent the shaded part. So we have this hundred frame and it's labeled so we know it's a hundred squares here. So that means you can say 10, 20, 30 and then count this 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So it's 36 of 100. To show that as a ratio, it's going to look like this. If you notice, it is a fraction again, and it's represented where it's, it's base 100 and it's 36 over 100. So we're looking like they're going, well, wait a minute, how do we figure this out for a percent? Well, you're going to see that here in a moment. We're going to show you the representation of 36 over 100 as a ratio, as a percent. Here's the percent. Now, to get you thinking about the next video, we're going to be talking about ratios, percents, fractions, and decimal. What do you think this could be represented as a decimal? And remember, to be a math person, all you have to be is a person that does math. Thank you. Remember to like, share, and subscribe.